Now, the former flag bearer of the Gambia Action Party has on Monday registered a new political party after gaining or gaining strength from a scandal that threatened his political career. The move comes 10 months after a nude video portraying his image went viral on social media. Bojan's party becomes the 18th political party registered in the Gambia. Bintajalo has the rest of that in the story. After months of struggling to clear his image on social media, Mr. Lyman Bojan bounces back with a new political party called Alliance for National Reorientation and Development. The party is formally registered with the Independent Electoral Commission on Monday, 3rd May 2021. The party's color is orange and its symbol is a bundle of harvested rice with a motto of justice, freedom and development. Speaking to journalists after the official registration, Mr. Bojan said, life is all about taking risk and the past can't end his career. If you do not take risk in life, it means you do not exist. Um, yes, pundits would have said that uh, my political career would have come to a stop. But I guess, um, like it is said uh, in our local languages, in the military it is often said that withdrawal is another phase of life, a phase of war. That was just um, hibernation. We went into hibernation just to make sure that we prepare ourselves better. We thought um, there were better you know, times, there were better ways to do stuff, and we have learned our lesson. Some will say that we've learned our lesson in a bitter way. Yes, we've learned our lessons in a bitter way. But this time around, I think we are better educated. We have the experience to be able to, you know, huddle through now better. Bojang advised Gambians to be aware of the leaders they will choose in the future. The Gambian people watch, watch, they must watch, they must watch and be very, very careful who comes to them to talk to them about politics in this country. I think we are tired of the politic of deception. I think we are tired of politic of lying. I think we are tired of that type of politics of, you know, expressing tribal sentiments. What we want Gambian people to understand is that let them take note of ANRD. Let them take note of ANRD. We are out to solve their problems. We are out to solve their problems. And we are telling Gambians that anybody who comes to you, watch the person. Let them, not those, let them not be those type of politicians who are out there to enrich themselves. General Bojan said the current president knows nothing of what he is doing as he lacks the experience. Like what we have today, the current uh, uh, president in this country is clueless because he has never had any experience in this country. He has no work experience, he has no um, uh, uh, job experience. Sometimes smart people will learn on the job. But for him, he has no job experience, he is not learning on the job, and that is why Gambia is, sink Gambia is sinking every day. Gambians are expected to go back to the polls in December 2021. Bojan's party becomes the 19th political party registered in the Gambia ahead of the much-anticipated presidential election. In 2016, only nine political parties were registered before the coalition was formed, excluding other independent candidates. For iAfrica News, Bintejalo. Bintejalo reporting there has retired General Bojan formed his own political party ahead of the December 4 presidential elections in the Gambia.